Hello, you lot. Welcome to the Theatre Royal Norwich. I'm going to guide you in the next few minutes around this wonderful theatre and how it is to be an audience member when you're watching a show. How to behave and what to do. What is the correct etiquette? Stick around. When you arrive, your coach driver will drop you off right outside the theatre. Now it's a busy pavement, so no mucking about. Best thing to do is all line up in an orderly fashion and wait for your teacher to take you in. When you come into the theatre, you'll notice the box office over there on the left. That's where you get your ticket. Also, you'll see the front of house staff. They're here to help you if there are any problems. Try and stay with your teacher. We don't want you getting lost. And keep an eye out for where the toilets are if you need to go. There's plenty just outside the auditorium. You can't miss them. You should ask an adult to take you as a group to the toilet. Here is the auditorium. All 1,306 seats. Imagine all that smiling back at you when you're on the stage. Oh, talking of seats, make sure you've got your ticket. Or maybe your teacher's got the ticket. What you do is you look at the number and the letter and you go to the seat that you're sitting in. Now, if you're right in the middle, you want to get here at least 15 minutes beforehand. Otherwise, you're going to disturb everybody as you get to your seat. And if you're late, well, chances are they're going to make you stay outside until there's a suitable moment for you to come into the show. So when you find your seat, and make sure you've got your right seat, we don't want you moving around during the performance, get yourself comfortable. It's the best way. Make sure your phone is turned off. We don't want them going off during the show. And don't get them out and start taking photographs. Flash photography is not allowed in the theatre. Get yourself seated. Put your sweets away. We don't want them rustling during the show. It's going to disturb everybody. And no talking. We don't want to disturb the actors. And whatever you do, don't start getting re relaxed and kicking the seat in front of you. It's only going to disturb everyone around you. Be dressed and as smart as these youngsters here. Well, they're all in their school uniform, so they're easy to pick out. And look how polite and nice they are. That's the best way to be at the theatre. Just sit back and watch the show. To signal the start of the show, the lights will go down. And then the curtain will rise. If you're sitting at the back of the theatre, you might want to hire some binoculars, but remember to put them back afterwards. We ask that you behave in a respectful manner when you're watching any performance at the theatre. But if you're here to see a pantomime or children's show, the cast love it when you join in. Everybody's going to find out. I think a few people have figured that out already. Shh. You can eat and drink in the auditorium, but try and keep it at quite a low level. Don't want to disturb people. And after you've finished, put your rubbish in the bags provided. During the interval, there is the chance to go to the toilet and buy sweets and drinks, but make sure you check with your teacher first. And don't wander off on your own. Your teacher may also have organised ice creams for the whole school using our pre-booking service. Ask me the time, madam. What's the time? It's funny at last, you should ask me that. I haven't got a watch, but lucky for you, I've got this big drum. Hey! Who's banging that drum at 9.15 in the morning? It's 9.15 in the morning.
make sure you take all your belongings with you when you leave. There is a lost property, but we don't look after everything forever. So now you know how to behave at a theatre. I hope you've enjoyed watching this little film. See you later. Ta-da!